cheating is like when you copy something down and you don't do something for yourself. Um, cheating is lying so you can get a better grade, but it's not fair. For me, cheating is a, a path that people decide because it is a choice to get out of things the easy way. Cheating is never a good thing. What would you say are different ways students cheat? Um, I'm pretty sure some people put it in their desks, like they have that little cubby. There was this one girl, she had um, a band-aid and she put like some of the answers on her band-aid and as she didn't know the answers, she just looked. Um, Quizlet or spark notes. Um, they use them um, to look up answers for the test. It was a long test and during lunch, they asked a smart kid for an answer and I guess they wrote it down in their test. Do you know what plagiarism is? Um, it's when you copy something down. So like, let's say you do an essay, Instead of putting it in your own words, you just copy-paste everything, and none of it's in your own words. Plagiarism is copying someone else's work. Maybe you look it up on the internet, copy and paste, or you ask a friend for their work, change it up a little, and still plagiarism. Why is plagiarism wrong? Um, because you're not, it's not your work, so you shouldn't, why should you be the one getting a good grade for someone else's work? When you're caught, you definitely you get suspended or you get kicked out of class. You know, you don't get as m many chances as you do in middle school or in high school. How do you avoid plagiarism? They should um, put the website in their bibliography so that it's not plagiarizing. Uh, cite it. Uh, you can have an extra page for citations for websites you've used so you can give or websites or the people credit or books, newspapers, so they get the credit for their work. Do you know what collusion is? So many big words. Um, um I don't know. Collusion. Um, I've never heard that word. <laughs> talking to someone else about what their answer is for. Giving them an answer, like when they're not supposed to be like working together. So collusion is working together on a class assignment without the teacher's permission. Have you ever colluded? Yes, I, I have uh, worked on projects together with people. Do you think you've ever colluded? Ye uh, yes. But maybe they don't consider it cheating, cheating. Just kind of asking them for help. I think you still can ask a friend for help but you have to put some sort of restriction of how much help. What consequences do you think should take place for those who cheat? Um, th their grade could be lowered. Um, that and maybe get tell their parents. They should take out the test. They, they shouldn't have any chances because, I mean, it's a test. And they should probably get suspended for a couple of days. But like, if it was an in-school suspension, you could make them study. Do you have any advice? I would say it's not worth it. And one thing that they always told me is that you're only cheating yourself. 